what's up y'all so was was the mod prank real this is queen paris she has come to state her peace and girl we've been waiting <laughs> about time anyway uh let's get into it first of all the christmas tree is given the couch is given let's get into it <laughs> Y'all yeah, seen that shit, Miles. I ain't even had shit to do with it. I ain't had shit to do with it. Anyway, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host. And today, I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying? And what the goddamn hell y'all leave? So, I already read the title. Let's get into it. What's up, y'all? Ooh, is it dark? I just came to sit down. I ain't say hey. So, <laughs> as y'all can tell by the title, I am going to be addressing some things that Mod said in his video about me. First of all, I got me some salad. Them so good, child, but my teeth ain't no good, so I can't even do it. Patches and But do water. it, sis, for me. Then I'm gonna be hitting this thing right here, some THC, Pear. um, Delta Eight, whatever. It's good, whatever. I'm about to get high a little bit. Oh. Okay, so here's a little disclaimer. Well, we know you get high. Before we get into it, <laughs> uh, I I was going back and forth with myself, and I was asking myself, I was you know trying to before I actually do stuff. Or do anything i like to you know think twice about it or actually like analyze like make sure that i'm doing it for a good reason and just basically um i didn't want to make it seem like i'm doing this for clout girl we know you're doing this for clout we all doing this shit for clout damn <laughs> stop saying i'm not doing it for clout when you are you're not on the internet for free. Mine did it for clout. <laughs> I don't want y'all to think that. And honestly, I'm doing this video because I just feel like it'd be good for content. Shit. Clout. He did a whole video, a 45 minute video. Clout. Clearly it's like important or he had a lot to say. Girl, clout. When he could have, you know, I still feel like he could have called me. At the end of the day, or answer my phone call, I, I call like I two, three times and text more than one time. I agree with that. Before he even made the video, before I even said anything about him not, re you know, responding to me, I just feel like, I feel like if he felt like whatever he well, felt I ain't like gonna lie, you started it. You came to the internet first. I'm gonna tell you right now, when you started, everybody else got, they, how everybody else handling, handle it, you brought it on yourself. I, trust me, I done brought this shit on myself a couple times, speaking first. So, friend, you brought this on yourself. Now you got to deal with it. <laughs> In the video, I watched the whole video, and it's some stuff that I want to, like, address. Girl, get to it, please. And even when I mentioned it before, I even like it. It's not even, like, I'm going to say it to you. Like, I'm not going to take it to the end. Like, I'm not even like it. It's not even my character. Carrots. And even when I mentioned it before, like when I was telling y'all on my live, and even when I mentioned it in the video, I only did that because y'all were on my ass. I'm pretty sure y'all was on his ass too about why, why we wasn't doing videos and stuff like that. So how can we go from making videos back to back to not making none? You know what I'm saying? So it was just, I got, I get why people was asking us or asking me um, where we was like, what happened to us or whatever. So I just simply said, what happened? I didn't bash him. I didn't try to make him look bad. And if I did. Diddy, you have to cut on the tree. It's not on. Huh. Hey. I apologize for that. But that wasn't my intention. Maybe I should just keep my mouth closed. I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Things could have went. Bitch, if you ain't say nothing, I promise you he wouldn't have said nothing. Things can go different ways. You know, you just never know what. But I did what I feel like was right at the time. And yeah, so. 
Give me one of them damn things. So I got a few things. I wrote a few things down. And Friend. Shit. His title was Mod and Paris, the failed internet love story. Addressed it all. Hope out now. That title was so OD. <laughs> it was so like, first of all, where did the failed internet love story came? Like, where did that come from? Where? YouTube. Clout. Cap. Clickbait. Where did the love story come from? I'm confused. Don't be. I was so confused about the title. I was like, now this is this is doing too much. And I even texted him and I told him, I said, this is doing way too much. Like, what do you mean? And he was like, um, your title was doing too much. And I was like, no, my title was me and my beefing question mark because that's what someone sent me. Like, people are asking me, are we beefing? Because we ain't putting out content. Simple as that. But yeah, title OD. I didn't like the title or whatever, but that's that. Um, another thing that I wanted to talk about was the prank video. Um, a lot of people had a lot of like questions about was it real, like, or was it a prank? And okay, so before I did the video, as he mentioned in the in his video that. I did reach out to him because I was like, I said, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I want to do a prank on you. I said, I'm going to prank you, um, texting you. I'm, I said, I'm going to prank you, texting you, telling you that I got feelings for you, blah, blah, blah. Boom. And that's what I told him. For him to, now, for him to say on camera that I texted him and I did that, like, that's just crazy because it's like, no. As, that's what the fuck you just said, you damn Sagittarius. <laughs> Let me look. As a content creator, like I've never heard nobody physically say on YouTube that a prank was playing. Girl, they say it all the time. I done tried to tell y'all. This shit is for entertainment. All that other shit ain't got nothing to do with me, okay? And like the other person knew about the prank. We had the conversation, yeah, but I never seen nobody on. I didn't even know that's what... I didn't even know that... Girl, he snitched on the operation. I get it. Like, that's how pranks were, you know, made. And he was like, um, yeah, so whenever you... Blah, blah, blah. Like, whenever you want to do, like, a prank or something... Or Friend, it's fake. We know. That being said, was my feelings real in the video? Like I said, like, it was a prank. It was a freaking prank. How in the freak can I form feelings? I don't know. I don't know if people do that, but I don't form feelings. I don't have, I don't form feelings with people that I have just met and only did YouTube videos with. And, right. and he, he kept saying like, it was like work relationship. And that is true. Like it was like work. And I said in the beginning of that video, I said, I'm, I'm trying to spice it up. I'm trying to, you know, create some good content. I thought that's what we was doing. You was trying to get a bag. Which is, this is where I'm on your side, cause bitch. A bitch was just trying to get a bag and he just blew the bag. I just don't think he need to do videos with women uh, on YouTube. <laughs> like, it's not his thing. In the first place, I thought like, this is what we was doing. So, um, yeah, so with that video, it was a prank. Those feelings were not real. It was literally me just getting his reaction to see if, how he would react if I told him I had feelings for him. Great content, right? Maybe I was, you know, maybe I did take it, you know, too far saying, um, it got real. Maybe that was taking it too far, but shit, that is, to me, I was just, you know, giving y'all content. Okay. It is what it is. You know, maybe I shouldn't have did it that way. Who knows? It happened or what. Friend, you just shouldn't have did it with him. All right, we're going one, two, three, four, five, six. Prank like it's a joke. <laughs> That's how I look. One, two, three, four, five, say, six. Like, he wasn't that serious and went that deep. And for him to say, like, um, he kind of, he was just like, oh, like, damn, like, she really catching feelings. No. <laughs> no, baby. You, from, when I, if I, if, when me catching feelings with anybody, baby, I like to be wine and dime. I like hell of attention. You got to um, show me that you are interested in me before I show you that I'm interested in you. Like, I mean, it's, it could be mutual, but at the end of the day, like, I'm a woman, and I feel like 
if I'm gonna put myself out there and tell people I'm liking somebody or I'm feeling somebody, that person gonna have to, he he that person is gonna have to like really like put some work in. You know what I'm saying? So and that's what he didn't want. He didn't want that shit anyway. <laughs> he already didn't want to wind and dine you. I feel like you might have gave him you wanted to be wind and dine vibes. And he already said that ain't what he wanted. Everything that she's saying is what he did not want. And I think that, like I said, <laughs> he, he kind of dodged the bullet on this one. You know, I'm not going to lie. Oh, yeah, like, he know that wasn't, he know it wasn't, that series it was just a prank we already discussed that all right friend it was about 10 minutes all right so the next thing that i want to talk about Ooh. is him bringing up that i'm a stripper i don't care if you are sam if your intentions are good or if your intentions are bad you bring up that i'm a stripper it has nothing to do with none of this it has nothing to do with nothing because in the beginning before you even before we even made a video before we even decided to link up you knew that i was a stripper or that that stripper was my um job like that's what i do like so i think that's why he brought it up friend but i mean to be honest you know from the looks of even her home it looks like she takes great care of herself so i honestly that shit would need that's my job it is and it is. i just felt like that coming like it, like saying anything about and me he said that she brought he said that she was bringing up her being a stripper more than him he was saying that he didn't want to whoo he was saying that he didn't want to give content around her being a stripper because he had certain respect for her. This just wasn't going to work. Y'all, th th this shit just wasn't going to work. At all. I'm, I'm glad they both ended it. Being a stripper or ha making that, you know, or making that have something to do with you not responding to me. Like, you already knew that I was... I mean, I agree, uh, KJ. It didn't. It didn't have nothing to do with the price of tea in China, but... I'm just saying, friend, you are, she is a stripper. Like, I just, I don't know. I, I wouldn't have been offended. She brings it up. But he was just telling his side of the story as to why he kind of didn't want to fuck with her. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like, you know, he had the right to tell that truth. But not only that, I mean, hell. <laughs> she set him up for it. She kind of started this. So, you know. She started this, friend. She started this. She was from the beginning, so she I was so confused it. about that. And I was just like, I knew this was going to happen at some point. That somebody was just going to, like, use me being a stripper to make up anything. Because, first of all, baby, I know who I am as a person. I am the most it. genuine, nice person. Y'all, he didn't use it against her, though. The stripper thing, he did not use it against her. So I'm confused. And ever like like literally my intentions are so pure i do everything with love and i do everything with pure intentions with like me you're a sagittarius i don't believe that shit and you know i i hope you don't respond because i do know that this is entertainment i do not know you however sagittarius from the ones that i've met ha! child they will say i'm doing this and they're not you know, truthfully, her intentions were to get clout and, and, and you know, get a bag. That's that that was the intention. <laughs> and I think people should be honest about that. Look, I mean no with you. I wish if I could go back to a couple people, I would I would I would recite that. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, you know, everybody is afraid of that clout word. And to be honest, bitch, I'm not on here working for free. And when I realized this is really my job <laughs> and like, I'm not telling y'all how to work at your job. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, we all are doing this to grow. We're doing this to make money. This is not one of those. I just want to do this because I just genuinely want to like, it's not even that unless you're already rich. Now there's some people that's just already rich who don't give a damn about YouTube. 
you know, and it is what it is. Could you create a relationship or friendship or a partnership off of uh, working together for clout? Yes. Nigga, scratch my back, I scratch yours. Hell. <laughs> but if I'm the only one doing the scratching, then I would completely understand why you wouldn't want to fuck with me anymore. I completely understand why I'm not working with a lot of people today. You know what I'm saying? For my reasons. And they have theirs. But it's because we're not clear in the beginning. I, it's a lot of business deals that I wish I had more clarity in the beginning. Okay? But at the end of the day, I do not work for free. I have bills to pay. You want to get clout? So do I, bitch. Let me do my video. You do yours. If the shit do good, bet we can work some more. If we become friends off of it, bet we became friends. If we date off of this, bet we we date. Like, you know, but at the end of the day, we all got shit to do. He being a stripper ain't got nothing to do with nothing. And it's just period. So, pipe down on the stripper comments because, baby. Oh, I'll she be mad with. at the people in them comments. Because the nigga didn't say nothing against her being a stripper at all. I watched that. I could vouch for that. He really did not disrespect her at all with the stripper shit. She in a minute and y'all going yelling with him and this is ah. <laughs> So the comment that I made when I was like, um, he ain't taking me on a date yet. I was responding to like one of my supporters under my post and I guess he saw that. Of course he did. That's why he took me on a date. Which was like, I just felt like with this whole thing, honestly, I'm going I'm to say this. And I ain't trying to point fingers, cause I take, I'm, I hold, you know, I take responsibility for whatever I did, you know, if he offended anybody or whatever. But Clarence is the one that hyped all this shit up. I agree with that a hundred percent. I'ma just say that he the one that hyped it up. He the one that said, um, I got a new girl. I'll I hope Clarence reacted this, but I, I think, I think he genuinely want to see him with a with a woman. <laughs> I, I can't get mad at that. But absolutely, it's absolutely his fault, 100%. All this, you know, joint, whatever they be saying. He the one that said that. I agree. And he was saying it, like, he was just hyping it up. I, I mean, I was, I was cool with it. She was trying it, to get a bag, I, I didn't too. I think that it would be... Girl, you trying to get a bag. It, it would, <laughs> like, get to this because it wasn't that serious. Like, it was just us doing videos. Period. And I respect it and I um, appreciate... Um, my and Clarence for like really like you know giving me the subscribers that I had and giving me the 10k and all it is but Clarence was the one that hyped it up and did the most and it was you know it was that but um that comment when I said that he ain't taking me on a date it wasn't necessarily me saying that I want him to take me on a date it would have been good for content I mean and then let me it. say this, since we want to talk about, you know, stuff that really don't, doesn't matter. But, shit, he reached out to me, asking me if I wanted to do um a blind date. Him, him, me, and Clarence would be doing a blind date. So, it's like, how is it, how is this all, like, a thing when the... You just shouldn't have brought it up, friend. Content was going to be put out anyway. So I'm just, I'm just, I was just so confused about the whole 40 minute long video when I didn't even get a phone call. You got my number. So I'm just, I was just a little bit confused. I'm like, I even texted him. I'm like, bro, what is this? <laughs> what is this? And I'm working together if we are work friends. You feel what I'm saying? So at least talk to me. Tell me, like, if you was going through something, it ain't nothing to pick up a phone. You was posting on Instagram, you know what I'm saying? Like, so, I just feel like him ignoring me, ghosting me, was just uncalls for. Like, that's what I said. Like, I hate when people say uncalls for. Like, whatever happened to the ED? I hate uncalls for. That shit drives me crazy. Ignoring me, ghosting me, was just uncalls for. Like, that's what I said. Like, I said it's uncalls for. Like, all you had to do was hit me up one time. One text would have solved all of this. Literally. I agree he should have hit you up, but the thing is, he did not have to. And that's what people got to realize. Like, people don't. They don't have to do what they don't want to do. That's a fact. Like, they don't. That's why you got to bow out. Bitch, I'm out then. If, like I say, if I'm the issue, I'm out. You can't make nobody do nothing they don't want to do. So she should have just left his ass the fuck alone and took it for what it was.
told them to hit him up. Told the fans, hit his ass up then, cuz shit. I, I, I called him. He ain't wanna answer. You, hey, I'm done. That's what, hey, bitch. Literally, Clarence, I had, I had answered that question and he was like, I'm not new, I'm, I'm like, I'm new to um, this lifestyle. Some shit he said, basically saying like, like, what did he say? Oh my God, I forgot what he said. But he said something on the, the lines of, uh -huh. basically, I'm not used to this. And me answering that, that question wasn't necessary or some shit. Don't quote me on what he said, but I, I feel some type of way because, first of all, first of all, I am mature enough. I am wise enough to, and I, and I have self-control. Like, me meeting, like, I meet celebrities all the fucking time. I agree. I <laughs> believe that, especially if she work in magic, okay? <laughs> like so whether I was gonna collab with Queen and Clarence how was that oh. me not being used to like this lifestyle because first of all before you oh nah no 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 see first of all if they take you in an intimate setting which is why I always tell y'all I don't give a damn who like me and who don't at one point these people brought me in their house you get what I'm saying whether you like me whether you don't I'm just not going to come on the internet and do no shit talking crazy about these people. I'm not doing it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And um, the problem is when people go into other people's house, you, you, you bring them in your house, and then they get to tell them what's going on in the house just like you did. She the one who came to the internet talking about, um, Mod cut her off and a whole bunch of shit that nobody asked her for. None of us. Nobody was like, why y'all out there? <laughs> nobody asked you for this. So you bring that to the internet. Ain't no telling what you will bring to the internet. So I wouldn't have trusted her either after she did that shit. I wouldn't have trusted her no further than I could see her. Okay? Um. So I don't know why she's so confused at that. But everybody's logic just different. YouTube, baby. I know hella celebrities. I don't follow them. I don't be on a dick. I don't be, I don't do none of that. So for him to say that me answering that question wasn't cause for, like, I, I'm not used to this lifestyle and I'm just being hyped up about certain shit, that ain't got nothing to do with it. Like I said, I answered the question, of course I would love to collab with Queen. We know, but you collabing with, with um, Queen and Clarence would have brought her a hell of a bag. But you already putting him on the internet for not texting you back. <laughs> like, him not texting you back, you done brought that shit to the internet or calling you back or answering the phone, whatever, child. So, no, I wouldn't have trusted her neither, bro. When it's enough to just hit, like, you know, even respond to one minute. You didn't even have to pick up the phone. You could have responded. You could have responded to it. Honestly, she should have took him not answering as an answer and i don't know why people don't take people not answering as an answer as well if you see this man is on instagram alive he's not answering you on purpose so that was an answer he didn't have to answer you and i know it would be convenient for him to answer you it definitely would be the principalities for me as well however he ain't answering he ain't answering it is what it is you know what I'm saying? One message I sent before all this happened, before I got on live, you could have responded to one message and we would have been and just said, like, I'm going through something right now. Maybe we can create content a little bit later or express what you expressed in that video to me. I am very understanding. I know how to take, um, criticism. Um, I, I mean, I'm good with rejection. Like, I don't care. Like, that, like, I know how to adjust myself when needed. So it's like, if he could have, if he would have just hit me up. I disagree because he clearly, you know, and this is respectfully saying he clearly rejected her, y'all. He already rejected her. He already rejected her. And she could not handle that because she had to bring this shit to YouTube. So. I've been like, shit, like, I feel like this is too much, blah, 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 like. 
I ain't mean to get this far. I ain't mean to go like this. Boom. Understood. Understood. On to the next. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not the type of person. I'm not act like it, I'm not acting like it wouldn't be convenient for that text. And I mean, honestly, he could have been man enough to do it. However, he didn't. <laughs> so it's like, how do we move on from here? Saying to like, I'm not the type of person to like, you know, make things worse than what it is. That's why it took me a little minute to even make this video because I'm like, should I even do it or not? Like. But, like I said, it's good for content, so I'm doing it. But anyways, yeah, I just feel like that. Like, he should have just hit me up and responded to my message in the first place. Like, you, like, when I'm at work, it, it's like girls be want to, like, you know, be for me. And I'm not on that. I'm not, my, literally, that shit don't even enter my, all of that really don't even enter inner my. matrix. Your inner matrix. My mind, like, that's, they don't have, like. I vibrate so high. Mm. I vibrate no, that so high. Hurt. Like anything negative does not entertain me. Like that, like I try to stay away from anything negative. I literally try my best to stay away from anything negative. I can't. See, that's when that Sag Sagittarius shit be sounding like cat. Because why would she bring it to the internet? She she should have known that bringing this to the internet would have been negative. I mean, especially for the nigga to even respond. <laughs> like, she should have known this would have been negative. So, you know, it'd be them contradicting ass Sagittarius, man. But, um, well, I'm not speaking for all y'all. You know what I'm saying? Don't claim it if that ain't what you is. But that's what she's <laughs> like to me. But respect to a man. Get your money, sis. Fuck all that other shit. At this point, it don't even matter. <laughs> okay? You know, she got a, a beautiful home. You know what I'm saying? She take good care of herself. She's a pretty woman. Girl, I say do you. Everybody just go their separate ways. Okay, but anyway, I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Hey, yeah.